All right, let's give y'all an update on the Jonathan Majors case. Now, if y'all remember, he was arrested on March 25th for allegedly abusing his girlfriend. Now, we just got reports that multiple victims are now working with the district's attorney's office and basically coming forward to say, hey, he abused me too. Now, remember when this whole thing first broke out, his lawyer was saying, hey, we have evidence that Jonathan Majors didn't do anything. And now it's April 20th and they've given us this. So apparently, instead of the video that they were claiming that they had, they're coming out with some photos of Jonathan's ex-girlfriend basically saying, hey, she wasn't abused after she went to the club following their altercation. So apparently they had an argument and then she went to the club. So you can see her at the club having a good time. Um, they're trying to show, I guess, her body. Does it look like she has any bruises? I can't really see anything. Plus, these are black and white pictures. Um, Jonathan Major says the man who was driving him and his now ex-girlfriend the night of their alleged domestic incident will testify the actor did not strike her and he claims there's video proof she was not injured when she met or went out to the club after their altercation. Now, okay, the driver is supposed to testify, but where's the video? Is, is this screenshots from the video? Because if you ask me, it still looks a little shaky. And like I said, it's almost a whole month later. And this is the first piece of evidence you're giving us to try to say that he's not guilty. It still seems a little shaky. And that's why you hear about Jonathan Majors losing all of these deals. He's potentially getting ready to get replaced in the Marvel movies. You know, the Marvel movies that are made by Disney. And when I say Disney, y'all know Disney not playing no domestic violence case with an African-American actor, okay? You know, if it was Johnny Depp or somebody, they'll give it some time. They'll wait after the trial. But Jonathan Majors, I hear they're already trying to replace him with the guy from uh, Snowfall, the leading actor from Snowfall. They said he's going to replace Jonathan Majors in the Marvel movies. Also, since the new victims are coming out, the lawyer has spoke again and he said Jonathan Majors is innocent and has not abused anyone. We have provided irrefutable evidence to the district attorney that the charges are false. We are confident that he will be fully exonerated. This comes after a report from Variety that says multiple alleged victims are working with the district attorney's office against Majors. So as of right now, it seems like Majors is still confident and we'll see if he's exonerated. But I'll say this, if he's losing all of these deals, don't expect to get some of these opportunities back, even if it comes out that he didn't do anything. Also, we heard the ex-girlfriend say, um, I think she said she blamed herself for them having the altercation, but she didn't say he didn't hit her. She just said it was her fault that they were arguing because a lot of people are getting that mixed up. A lot of people think the girlfriend said Jonathan didn't do anything to her. She basically just said, you know, it was my fault we were arguing and see these photos or that statement from the ex-girlfriend in my opinion are not helping jonathan as it pertains to the public we'll see what happens with the district attorney and the evidence that they may have seen that the public hasn't seen but for right now i just think everything is up in the air for jonathan majors but 
Y'all let me know what y'all think. Um, do y'all think Jonathan is innocent? I hear some people saying he shouldn't have been messing with a white woman. I'm not going to go that far. But y'all let me know. Make sure you like the video and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.